Judy that we get to just know her and walk through life with her and, and here she is and we love her God and we just thank you for her life and that we get to know her and uh, Father in the next few minutes here I just pray in Jesus name for the supernatural to happen for the, God that we would get words from heaven for Judy that will bless her encourage her God and, uh, and, and prod her on as she serves you in Jesus name First thing I got for you, Judy, is those that pour out to others, themselves would be filled with overflowing. You're yeah. so kind, Judy. And you're always available for other people. Yes. And so I just thank you that rivers of living water continue to flood through you. And that you just enter into the river of um, this new year. That you um, participate in everything that God calls you to do. And that it's just... Uh, joy, joy, joy. Drink, drink, drink. Thank you. Judy, I had a picture for you. Run away. I saw you in a Superman outfit. And I saw a B, A, M, BAM! You know, like that. And I felt that it had to do with evangelism. I feel like the Lord is going to give you the ability to break through walls as you speak to people. You'll be like the dynamic person who can... <clears throat> See through walls, speak through walls, break through for other people, to bring them to the Lord. So uh, if they relate to that at all, Judy, I just right now bless you as an evangelist with great power and authority to speak into people's hearts, to declare things into their thought life, to uh, reveal Christ's character to others in Jesus' name. Oh, yeah. Thank you. It's a pretty big honor. <laughs> I just see a lot of mountains before you, like in Switzerland, you know, beautiful, mm -hmm. steep mountains. And those are pictures of the future, that God has a lot more uh, new uh, challenges ahead of you. You're just starting to just move into a whole, a whole new realms of, and you're going to climb those mountains and achieve new victories for me, saith the Lord, that you never even dreamed possible. Mm -hmm. So I see you climbing those mountains. In the power of the Holy Spirit. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. I like climbing mountains. Oh, do you? Uh huh. It's pretty good. Judy, I see you steadfastness and perseverance. <clears throat> you keep plodding along and don't give up. That will go good with climbing those mountains for sure. Thank you. And I saw along with that is tenacity. And that, that tenacity is going to give you a long life and life that is full and life that is rewarded in a long life. Tenacity. And I see an eagle. So Can we Lord, pass this on? I'll take this. So as an eagle, you know, it, it has great insight and foresight and can see way beyond what any other creature can see. And so we just... I'm just decreeing that there's more revelation, more um, power in your words, discernment, and wisdom coming forth this year. Amen. I saw something similar. I saw you really giving a lot of life to young people. So I don't know what you do with your time, but I would encourage you to get in touch with a lot of young people and share with them your story because that's what you have to give to them. And there's so many of them here that they'd be longing, you know, to have fellowship with you. So I encourage you to do that. Think about it. Pray I about it. I something that confirms that. I asked the Lord, and he showed me a, a chicken farm. And uh, there's all these young chicks sitting on the eggs. And I saw you as a mother chick going around, pecking the different little chicks as they sit, guide them and encourage them. So whatever you said, I saw, you, God has in you what the younger generation needs to do life. And so may the Lord give you strength and energy and may they flock to you so you can share with them what God entrusted you with. Yeah. Amen. It's yeah. a gift you have, you know, so you do want to go after it. <clears throat> I know, Judy, you are already a great light to your family members. Uh, you love them. You bless them. You're a great light. But I see your light just getting even exponentially brighter among all your family members. And they're just going to love you even more and be drawn to you in a greater way, to Christ. 
the Christ within you. Um, yeah, I just feel like you have a great inheritance, Judy, in your family, mm-hmm. and you're blessed with that inheritance. Um, and also, I was just thinking of Billy Graham Library, that um, those that delight themselves in the Lord will get the desires of their heart. And I know your great desire is to see people that come into that library receive Jesus into their heart. And I thank you, that, um, Lord, that there will be many more opportunities for Jesus, uh, Judy to... Um, share Jesus with people mm-hmm. and um, have them have listening ears and uh, that she'll see the reward of uh, Jesus' suffering. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, days aren't finished yet, Judy. Your days still have a lot to come forth in more abundance and more blessing. Thank you. Yeah, very much to other people especially. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Mm-hmm. bless you. Father, we bless Judy with this, all these exhortations, and so interesting that you're calling her to um, to minister and to speak into young yes, lives. Yes, yes. And we pray, God, for opportunity yes, and open yes. doors, and God, the boldness to walk through every door that you open. Amen. God, in Jesus' name, just Amen. sail of all these words and bless Thank Judy. You, Amen. 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 Thank you very much. Yeah. Growing old for better things. She's flying high like the eagle. I like it. She's wearing that eagle because she's flying high. Flying high. <laughs> and the Lord is restoring the youth, your youth. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> yeah, I see you gliding like those eagles outside that I look at. Yeah. Are they all eagles? A new, yeah. a new level. Well, I claim that they're eagles. Yes. I don't know what they are, but they look like eagles. <laughs> Somebody told me they're not eagles, but they look like eagles. They're flying high. Yeah, they're flying high. And they fly on the, on the wings of the Holy Spirit. You know, they just go like this. They soar. They soar. And they glide. They just glide. There's no effort, you know. Just gliding. I see a big wow. wolf of the Holy Spirit as you're out there this big wolf of the Holy Spirit coming under you and just lifting you up <laughs> yeah. higher heights than you have ever known my daughter higher heights than you have ever known <laughs> Youth renewal, I guess. Yeah. Was that spoken? That, that's what it is, you know. That he keep you strong and, and flexible and your mind, a good mind, and, and um, steady and steadfast, and that you, know, you are as young young thinker, your brain is young, we speak that over you, uh, uh, let's just ask for a new brain and a new heart and new organs that restore your youth. Amen. As the, what's that, as the, what's the, the Lord will restore you? As the eagle. As the eagle. As the eagle. That's yes. Yes. That, yes. That, that, yes. Thank you. Thank you. And that's what I saw you, the eagle, so we're going to yes. claim that too. The Lord restore you. Well, the eagle grows up and sits on the rock and they call it molting. Right. He sits there and he... <coughs> Pulls out his feathers and yes, yes. grinds his beak down, and he has to wait until those feathers grow back in. Right. But when they grow back in, yeah. he's stronger than ever. I just said, your feathers are definitely growing back in. Yes. You're coming forth. You're yes. coming forth. Yes. This is a new beginning for you, Amen. Judy. A new beginning. Hallelujah. Amen. 